morning. Welcome to Sun Prairie. It's a gorgeous morning for a bike race, but first, uh, some breakfast. Let's go. I'm like, I have to like walk myself because I'm like really like struggling. Like you can't like I not can't. race yeah. hard. <laughs> yeah. I have to like make the right decision. Yeah. To, like, no. Be strong I think in Vegas. Most of the pros aren't racing. Today. No, everybody does. Real. I think I'm the only one. Uh, Can our field? Because yeah. Jeremy and Hyde aren't racing. In the yeah, field. but the girls, you know where, how we are. Well, I think a but lot of our women love racing two two days, but like for me, most of the time I'll just race. One yeah, but like day. I think if I want to be good in Vegas. Mm -hmm. And then Iowa, I have to like skip this one. Yeah, especially you're kind of getting old, so yeah. I feel like you can't. <laughs> Did you hear that? <laughs> Did I'm old? I'm just keeping yeah, it. Yeah, but my you? old butt still kick your butt, so what the fuck I are you know, doing? I just, I need to work on right? that, right? <laughs> you guys got any stickers? Stickers. Do you have any stickers? I already give them enough shit as it is, and sometimes I think I'm bordering on uh, being like too abusive. So to purposefully give him shit just because there's a camera pointed on us, that might just be pushing things a little over the top. I don't know if uh, he'd want to work with me anymore where I have to do something like that. And unfortunately, I need him. Are you going to put this one in black and white so it's like a vintage film of us working on cantilever bikes? <laughs> Well, I'm really nervous right now. I don't really know why, but I am. Um, I'm glad to be back racing home in Wisconsin. And this course is awesome, even better than last year. I think I'm really nervous just because we have a big week ahead. And it's a bit stressful, but my family's here, so I'm going to try to just do my best and have fun, because that's all I can ask of myself. So, yes. <laughs> yeah, you know, problem is, is trying to get. Um, food for us, you know, without leaving, it's, it's so much work sometimes. And then we've got a couple different palates to entertain, like Bobby's a vegetarian, so he can't eat any of that. So we've got two big acorn squashes going there, so we've got some butter and a little bit of seasoning. Where is that? And we've got some brown sugar to put in that acorn squash, you know, just like down home. So it'll be good. <laughs> Okay, use your Maxis beach towel. I need like a, one of those, there we go. Like one of those traps. Okay. 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 Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Yeah.
for your women's elite podium! She looks pretty spent. When's your wife due? Um, October 23rd. Oh, that's so exciting. I know. Congrats. Thank you. Yeah, we're, uh, it's a good thing they give you like nine months to prepare. Yeah, get everything built. Mm -hmm. So yeah, and like mentally prepared too. Yes. Yeah. Yeah, you seem a little stressed out. Yeah. Yeah. No. With the the baby coming. I mean, I think I think I'm like, my wife is good, and she's like, getting she's all the stresses, you know, over months of yeah. time. Yeah. But I'm like kind of just tranquilo now, and I'm gonna freak out when it actually. That's because you're on the road every weekend now. Yeah, but it was nice not being on the road. Yeah. yeah. Come on, cat. Lord! Is that Come on up. Put it down. There you go. Come on. Come on. This is a team workout. Come on, Steve. So I guess if I had to put it in a way that was brief and made somewhat some little sense, um, you can try to you can try to control as much as you want, but there are always other people with their fingers in the pot, so to speak. And no matter how dialed you think you have things, shit happens. Watch my back swing. Back. <laughs> Don't drop the espresso, that's more important. Oh, I checked that. I'm mostly reminiscing here because the first time I came to Trek, I was all behind the barriers with you and Jeremy and the whole team so it was like kind of weird to be back here now because last year I got to come here and kind of like intern with Aspire when I was racing for Jeremy's development team the Jam Fund so being back here uh, you know like on Aspire is like pretty cool this race kind of like it's kind of a good like marking point of where I've been throughout my career so it's like pretty exciting to be back and I hope that this will be my best result here yet feeling a lot more prepared than I have been in the past. So, yeah, feeling excited. Well, are you going to unzip your jersey? Yeah, I think you should put it like right here. Like right here? Very Caroline. That would be so Caroline. I was really dumb. How do I get it off? And I'm like, oh, it doesn't come off. You're like coats. <laughs> Boom! Angelo is well right there. Courtney McFadden from the second row.
about Wisconsin um, it's really big it's uh, roughly the same square mileage uh, acreage as California uh, you'd be surprised it's, it's condensed on a map because it it uh, topographically it sinks so much and comes up so much that if you stretched it out it'd be as long as California <laughs>
Yeah, Carrie. <laughs> I followed one of you know Van Aert's initial attack at about like a couple, you know, two minutes into that. I was like, oh, okay, maybe that wasn't a good idea. <laughs> This looks like the circus. Mercado. I've been through for a while and got my ankle. Welcome to the top <laughs> step of the podium. Woo! <laughs> it's hard to find your way in such a dark place. If I had some sort of shining light in my life that could help me out of this time to really find my way. I really wish that. I just, I just wish I felt like a normal person. Not like the shell of a person. <laughs> yeah. I don't know, Sam.